The promise of always and forever. Forget it. Our third episode of the season um, is unusual and cool in a bunch of different ways. First of all, it was directed by Joseph Morgan, who did a fantastic job. It was written by Michelle Paradise and Casey Perry, who did a fantastic job. And it is a totally unusual, out-of-time episode. Know where you're going, hon? It's basically an Elijah story, and it fills the seven years from when he has memory wiped and disappeared, and it tells the story of everything that happened in between. I thought I was the only one. What the hell do you want from me? Are there more of us? Where, where do we come from? What? What are we? Whatever game you're playing, I'm not interested. Please. I need you to help me. He has no idea who he is, doesn't know what he is, doesn't know where he came from, doesn't know how he got there, and we watch him slowly relearn to be a vampire. I have a name, too. Oh. You know. I'm sorry. Antoinette. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you, Antoinette. We watch him fall for a new woman because he's got no memory of Haley in his past at the moment. You are an amnesiac with zero life experience. You really think you ought to be planning surprises. Consider it a thank you for taking me under your wing these past few weeks. It was so much fun to strip Daniel, the actor, and the character of all knowledge and watch him rediscover bloodlust rediscover all the talents and curses that come with being a vampire. It really was an amazing chance to watch both the actor and the story reinvent itself in a way we, we had never done before. 